Good morning and welcome back to the channel. It is Wednesday the 13th of March 2024 and as you can see I'm back at Anfield. It's the day before match day uh, and we'll take a look at uh, what progress we have seen. Right, as you can see we're up in the air so we get on over Never look. I don't think there'd be much work going on from what I've seen from other videos where we're looking near complete or as much as is going on for now on this outside. So everything's looking neat and tidy. I think last time I was here they was doing jobs around the Forever Stones. A lot of jobs have been continued, still bits of capping and edging to go on the roof. That missing panel that was here somewhere is done. I say it's early in the morning, um, it's only seven o'clock, so I should be able to take a look in the windows. As you can see, looking very sort of empty and tidy now compared to other times. Still no signs of the rest of this sign being finished. The bits of tarmac that were remaining there have now, just get a bit higher out the way of the tree. See so bits of tarmac that were, I think they were there somewhere have been done so there the zoom of the TV trucks for tomorrow night's game at against uh, Sparta Prague. Now I did see from someone else's video they'd been moving I don't think they'd just been tidying these up. It looked like they'd been was moving the sections for the corner but they've it looks like they've just stacked them a bit better. Does anyone know what happened to what we presume was a scoreboard that were delivered around the same time as them? Because um, I don't think it's appeared anywhere. So the road pavements down there are fully complete now. Obviously still that one gap of cladding to go. And quite a bit of trim etc on the edges. Not sure what is left in this corner if any. Do 
just about seeing. No, it looks like it's fully complete now. I think there was some little bits missing. We'll go and have a look over the stadium. So because because it's Europa League, the sponsors have to have that stripe put down the middle and the top bit covered up seems a ridiculous decision um, because it's only LFC on the cop so that doesn't matter and I don't think there's anything on the main stand for him to cover So we get to this end where the night tick has to go. Um, always seems silly because everyone still knows that's a, a night tick, and what I don't know what harm it does, but I guess like that, rules are rules. I say we've seen the Odd small bits of work going on on this corner, but nothing major. So I think the fact that people, most people thought it was the end of the season, it seems likely. We're not, I mean, we're March now, so it's only May and it's the end of the season. So I can't see them hurrying now. I wonder if the same is going to be for these, this last row and the hospitality windows because there seems no sign of them appearing yet them boards I think there's disabled seats to go pitch of course looking perfect as they always do here we go I'll get the whole whole thing in so this will be my last video for about two weeks um, going away so won't be here so not that I don't think there'd be much change to see now to warrant visiting much anyway there might be tiny changes unless they get on with that corner or the hospitality windows i don't think there's much to see it looks like the outside is near there very tidy i know it's match day tomorrow but it's not usually this this tidy, roof's tidy. I say usually at seven o'clock the car park is full of contractors and etc coming in and as you can see there's a handful of cars and hardly anyone milling about so not expecting much to be going on. So we will leave it there. Once again, if you could like, share and subscribe, it'd be greatly appreciated. And say so it'll be about 10 days to two weeks before I'm, I'm back for another look. So hopefully there'll be a bit of progress to see. Um, and I will look forward to seeing you next time.